What's up everybody, it's Grim again, and we're back with another mod review. And today's mod is the Auto Fertilizer mod by Shrose. And Shrose, you may know from the creator of, or the maintainer of the GUI API, and the ID Resolver mod. So this guy knows what he's doing. And this is one of his older mods, and I really like this mod. It's really innovative and I've never seen anything done so this mod has three items and well two items and one block so you got this the first block is the sprinkler which is two iron ingots on each side and one iron ingot at the bottom middle with a water bucket in the middle and a bone meal at the top to get one sprinkler and using that sprinkler you can get a auto fertilizer boat by placing a boat above it and or you can change that sprinkler into a auto fertilizer cart by placing it above a mine cart. So now let's go out. Let's get some supplies. And I'll show you what this mod can do. So over here, I've set up a little test thing. Now if we go into our inventory, you see that it does use the GUI API and you can see how many different options this thing really does have it can it's it basically just fertilizes a whole bunch of stuff hardened lava and also has a pretty cool particle particle effect so i will i'll show you what it can do and you can change all of these to how this is just how um like important it's going to be so if grow flowers is at like 200 then it's going to be used above the most like Thing it's every tick that that's what that means. So auto fertil when you place the cart down, you can see it doesn't do anything. But when you right click, you can see particle effects, and you can see stuff start to grow. And let's move along the track, and you can see it do its work. And as you can see, it's not the best because it did replace a track piece, but still, for what it's worth, it's pretty awesome. Because it can grow cactus, as you can see, it's growing the cactus right now. And let's. Uh, oh, what? It. I'm wondering why it's. It should grow it to the full length, but I don't know why it's not. But that's it for the auto cart, which I think it's pretty cool. If you're traveling a long distance, you want to make it look all meadowy and fieldy. And one thing to note, because I got kind of confused on this. If we go into the mod settings, you can see that chance to go gr grow grass. When I first saw that, I thought it was originally the tall grass, but this mod's older and came out before tall grass was even added. So it's just to turn dirt into grass. Now, there's you can also use just the normal sprinkler, which instantly starts thinging or placing everything. And I've noticed a bug. You saw it right there. Um, when it can place block, it can replace itself with the flower. So that it's still it's not as overpowered because I guess you lose a sprinkler, but still. All right, and now the last part is the hover boat, which or well, not hover boat. That's another one of his mods that I'm going to update. But the fertilizer boat. What was this boat? I forgot what it's called. Whatever. Now this thing also has its own options, which you can change in here. You can change how high it, high it is. And work mode is when you, you have all the particles. But if you press space bar, it switches into boost mode, which I'll show off right now. And you get an extra boost. The particles go away. And you go faster. And everything's configurable. And as you can see, it's slower because I made it like that. And it can put out fire, and just, it, there was originally lava right there, but it's kind of got weird controls, but it's still pretty awesome. So, let's break this, actually. You can use it, it's like a boat or anything, or a minecart. Now, if we go over by this water, let me break some grass. You will see, let me just play some of this stuff. Let's get back in it. You'll see it automatically starts 
doing everything, planting, and even growing. So this thing's really useful for, I would, I don't know if I'd use it to fly around in, but I think I'd just have it like right above my farm area and just have it start um, like harvesting them super fast. And I think that's it for this mod. Let me just go check those options one more time to make sure. You can also change it so that it can only be powered by redstone. Um, oh, you can change the range of how far it will reach. So now it's going to reach a lot farther. And as we go, oh, better switch into power mode or whatever, work mode. And now you can see it's got a lot more reach on it and does a lot more. Um, and I think that that is it. That's the only other thing that you might have a issue with. It grows crops, seed crops, water fields, grows reed. You saw it grow the cactus. It can harden lava and put out the fire like you saw. And I think that is it. So, thanks for watching. Um, I want to say a big thanks to Shrose for letting me update this mod because this mod's really cool and one of the first ones that I ended up updating. So, yep. And I think that is it. So, thanks again, Shrose. Thanks everybody for watching. And I, I'll see you guys later. Bye.